December 1941, Chemo became the first camp to be established in Poland. The capacity of Chamo was 170,000 up to 360,000 people. Jews were brought under guard by train from Lodz. Victims were from Lodz ghetto and from 36 communities in western Poland. Chamo was the first Nazi camp where the main cause was to burn and gas victims. 800 people were brought to Chamo on the first day. Around 152,000 people were killed. Chelmo was in the top five of the most deadly extermination camp. Jews were forced to go into gas vans thinking they were going to shower. They didn't know what was going to happen to them until the gas was turned on. 50 to 70 people were jammed in the van each time. The bodies were then driven to the woods and buried, but then in 1942, two crematoriums were built and the bodies that were in the woods were then brought to the crematoriums in which they were burned. Jewish prisoners were selected to work. They had to remove dead bodies from the gas vans and burn them into the mass graves. They were also responsible for digging out and burning the previously buried bodies. The Germans abandoned the Chomo Killing Center on January 17, 1945 as the Soviet army approached. This place was a terror. Men and women, young and old, lost their lives. They went through a lot of starvation. They were literally looking like sticks at the end of the day. They went through a lot of brutal treatment plus executions and it was really sad. It was really sad because at the end of the day when they got rescued, they couldn't reunite with their families because of the fact that they got separated from them when they were brought to the camp. So hey guys, this is our end of our video. Hope you guys like it. We're just missing Edith, but yeah, this is basically our research on the concentration camp. Of Chamo.